Okay, I'm actually, I'm back. I forgot to tell you one other thing. Um, if you wanted to put some other branches, remember we talked about that, how you might want to put um, some smaller sprigs with green leaves. You can take and do like this and just make them coming off. And then if you want to put like some pine needles on them. Now I'm doing brown, but I'm going to put green right over top of this brown so it'll look more real that way. But you just take your... Um, brown and do that and then I'm going to use all three greens I love the greens in here there's a really dark green there's kind of a Kelly green there's a light green I like to put them all I even like to incorporate that that moss green in there too so you just take your color put some nice nice long pine needles on there and um, in the picture that we had some of ours um, had they had the the berries so you could also put a few berries in here if you wanted to but do wait to the very end to do your berries because they will um, <laughs> they'll get smeared if you're doing this green and you have red berries there it's going to smear the red and it's not going to look as pretty so I'm going to wait to do the red until after I get all my green on here and I still have one more green to go right I have the really pale green oh actually I have my moss green too Ooh, I like this I like mixing the greens it kind of looks it just looks more real to me. You can do it any way you want. If you just like one color of green, do one color of green. If you don't want to put this part on, if you just want it to be a branch, you can leave it a branch. Um, just do it however you like. Okay, and I think I'm ready for my red berries. I'm just going to stick a few little red berries hidden kind of in here, growing out of my hair. And maybe, maybe he's looking at those, thinking about eating one of those red berries, right? I bet he likes them okay that's it um and then once you have that done bring it up to the front table thanks bye